The Titan submersible catastrophically failed on its venture down to the Titanic, but it wasn't so much a failure of the technology as it was the incompetence of those who managed it, like the CEO Stockton Rush, who coincidentally perished aboard the tiny submersible after cutting corners and pushing the vessel well beyond its safe limits. Humanity has experimented with submersible technology since the 1500s. But it wasn't until the 1620s that the first navigable submarine built by Cornelis Drebbel truly demonstrated the technology's potential. The next impressive submersible was the 1775 Turtle designed by David Bushnell during the Revolutionary War. It ultimately failed its mission, but it at least managed to avoid sinking. Here's a replica in action. But the first arguably successful submarine that managed to accomplish its mission was the H.L. Hunley submarine, built by Horace Lawson Hunley during the American Civil War. The Hunley sank three different times, and on its second test, took the life of Horace Lawson Hunley himself. But on the third test, the vessel actually delivered its explosive payload and sank the USS Housatonic. However, because the Hunley was within the blast radius, everyone aboard was killed instantly. If you like my content, hit the like button and subscribe, and also check out my Patreon.